Well, Yuli, you're no strangers to Electric Mayhem, are you, where we find ourselves today? Certainly not, no. Why not? This is where we recorded our album, Follow Your Instincts, um, debut album. We spent something about a month, two months in here. Slept in here as well. Slept in here, yeah. Yeah. Literally. <laughs> Back <laughs> in that room, yeah. I slept in, in that live room, didn't I? <laughs> So you didn't leave for a few days? No. <laughs> Bit of hardcore. Nine, nine till two at night, nine in the morning till two at night. It was Mike that was working the artist, he was in here half eight crack of dawn. This was Mike managing the studio? This was Mike that was doing the doing the label, yeah, producing us. And uh, till 12 at night and then Les was booting us out, wasn't he? Now the album is out there now, Follow Your Instincts. Mm. So what sort of reaction have you had to it? Um, it's only just the distributor we've got on board, he's got it um, out and about just before Christmas, so it's mainly going to be this year now to see what happens with it. He got it on iTunes uh, just the end of December, so we'll plug in that now. It's all over the website, it's called Indie Distribution, and uh, we're going to see what we can make of it this year. It's a fascinating album because I've noticed that different people have very different favourite tracks, usually on an album. There are one or two tracks that are stand out that everybody really goes for, but everyone has different ideas with Follow Your mm. Instincts. In my experience, have you found similar things? I think that's, yeah, I think that's definitely the case because it's quite a diverse album. I mean, a um, song like French May is completely different to Follow Your Instincts, for example. Um, so it's open to a wide audience, um, but obviously we feel as if we've got our own touch on all the songs. So it's quite exciting that people are dish you know, saying different songs are their favourites rather than all picking one or two. So it's, it's good for us, we feel, anyway. Now you're recording this session tonight, I gather it's the first time you've been even in rehearsal for a month, isn't it, because of the Christmas break? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah that's uh, Jamie over there, Mexican our, our, our Mexican yeah. friend. <laughs> yeah, I went to Mexico for the holidays and just came back, so... How long were you in Mexico for, Jamie? How? How long were you in Mexico uh, for? For three weeks, yeah. So, coming back and get, trying to get the rust out of the fingers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it's going to work wonderfully. And there's a good reason to, to get the rust out of things, isn't there? Because you've got some really big gigs coming up. Mm. Yeah, we've got the Cavern coming up um, in February, 18th of Feb. So we're going to take a bus up from Nottingham. Will that be a bit of a moment playing the Cavern? That'll be probably the best gig for me. I mean, it's, it's the Cavern, isn't it? So mm. it's got some, you know, yeah. it's good. It's the Cavern. Um, and then we've got March, we've got the, the Central, um, our sort of local venue in Nottingham. That's about the, I think it's about the 19th. We'll check the dates for that on the MySpace. So what's the dream for 2010 then? Where do you hope to be by this time next year? What do you, what do you hope to have ticked off that mental tick sheet? We want to, want to have got our album out and got it recognised and get it... I mean, we want to get it played on the, on the sort of major radio stations, on Six Music. Uh, we're going to plug that hard because, I mean, they're great for up-and-coming music. Uh, just carry on with what we're doing and get it, get the music out there and hopefully get some success with it this year. We okay. can make the album work, you know. We wish you the very best of luck with all of that. You mentioned that you have got a MySpace site a couple of times. Where do people go to find it? Uh, it's just www.myspace.com forward slash EULA online. Um, obviously, EULA spelled E-U-L-E-R. And the online bit's important as well. Yes, that's right. If you just type in EULA, in fact, into MySpace, you'll find it. We're, we're the top, top one on there. But if you go on iTunes... It's all over there. Just put into the artist category, Eula, or follow your instincts, and uh, you'll get the results on us. In a train station in the middle of Rome, I see a girl whose destination unknown. Smartly dressed in a stylish black But she keeps no friends as she rides the tracks I watch her wandering aimlessly But she's no place to be and it's plain to see To me she's nothing but a mystery The strangest girl in history She moves in sad circles 